Hi, welcome back to Gem Pages Tutorials Get Started series. Today, I'll give you an introduction about the most essential section in the product pages of your website called Product Module. We'll discover how to use the product module in Gem Pages to create a high converting product page. We'll begin by adding a product module. To make this section more smartly organized, I recommend that you should use a row element first, before dropping contents into it. In this video, I'll show you how to design a custom product module in a page like home page, landing page, and more. So first, let's divide this row into three columns. We'll design in the first column first by dragging and dropping a product module into this column. In Settings panel, you can choose the product you want to display on this column. About the Dynamic option, I will illustrate how to use this option in the next tutorial on designing a product page. Let's customize the components in each product. By default, each product contains four basic elements of a product, like product image, product title, product price, and cart button. But notice that you can customize the look and feel, or delete a default element, or add any other elements into the product area if you want. There is a variety of product child elements like title, description, price, quantity, image, image list, Variants, Swatches, Cart Button, Meta Description. Let me show you an example of adding elements into this product module. Now I'm adding quantity and variance elements into this product. Quantity is an element which allows your customer to choose the number of products that they want to buy from your store. You can customize advanced settings like update price, show label, and customize its look and feel, etc. Variance element allows you to offer your customers the options for buying a product, things like size, color, etc. I'm showing you how I add a variance element to my design, then navigate to the settings panel and you can customize the look and feel for this element to make it more beautiful. So, as you have seen, designing a product module in your page is easy with only some clicks. Let's discover more videos in our tutorial series to build converting pages for your Shopify store. Thanks for joining me and see you in the next videos.